hello everyone in this video we will be discussing about the demonstration of the uh, top end model of the patient monitor that is m797 uh, so this is a fully modular monitor with the screen size of 17 inches we have the touch screen facility and uh, both knob operations available in this uh, so discussing about the fully modular monitor so at the back side We have a transport monitor at the back side which, is, uh, which measures all the 5 parameters, basic 5 matter, 12 parameters. Uh, this uh, small monitor can be easily detached from the uh, monitor like this. And this small monitor can be used uh, for transporting the patient within the hospital or it can be used for transporting the patient wherever uh, in the hospital as well as outside the hospital. So this has all the connectors on the side. These are all the connectors which are there on the side where you can connect all the parameters, uh, probes and as soon as you connect it back to the patient monitor, all the data will get transferred to the monitor which is there. So the transport modeler itself has a battery backup of uh, 8 hours and the, uh, the 797 as a whole has a battery backup of uh, 2 hours. Side, we have all the buttons. We have the shortcut buttons. This will be used for silencing the alarms. Uh, this is for freezing the waveforms. This is for taking out the printout from the thermal recorder. Uh, this is for activating and deactivated, deactivating the non noisy blood pressure. And this is for going into the main menu. So, as soon as you press it, you will go into the main menu. So, this, as I mentioned, that this is a touch screen monitor. So, we have all the shortcuts in the touch screen also available on the lower side. And these are all the waveforms which are coming and these are the uh, measured values which will be there, displayed on the monitor. So discussing about the upgradable parameters which are there. So on the left side we have the we have the place where you can mount any of the parameters module. So these are the plug and play kind of cassette thing. So as soon as you plug this on the monitor that parameter will get act activated and we have three more places for putting the upgradable or advanced parameters in this so this is this is the reason it is known as the fully modular monitor so for turning on the monitor there is a button on the left side which you have to press and hold and by the time i can show you on the right side we have the connectors for the interfacing so these are the connectors for the usb for connecting it with the uh, cms system and for connecting it with the slave display so we have four numbers of usb interface connectors over here where it, wherein you can export the data in the excel format or the uh, cms format so the monitor right now is running on the demo mode uh, so we are getting all the waveforms on this on this on the left side and these are the numerical values uh, if you still want to change the layout of the screen then it is it can be done you can go into the main menu then screen configuration and then screen layout so as per the requirement you can change the parameters uh, position as per the requirement you can move the parameters up and down also we have preset pre-configurable screen uh, in this which is big numerics then train display then oxygen all seven leads analysis or the seven leads waveform on the single display where you will be getting a simultaneous display of all the seven leads then we have the oxy crg then we have seven lead half wherein you will be getting the half screen of the seven leads and then rest of the parameters will be shown over here so this monitor is upgradable to any of the advanced parameters monitoring like ibp nmt agm etco2 this monitoring cardiac output so only you have to purchase the cassette of that on the left side like this and that can be placed the software is already built in this so you just have to buy the cassette of that or the upgradable module for that particular parameter and that can be upgraded. 